Alrighty, and we are back. Um, you're gonna wanna. I'm gonna turn this episode into a boss time episode, but you're gonna wanna go in with full health and firepower. Make sure to save before. If you don't, if you if you want a big heart location, check the dresser in the baby's room. That always comes back. It's always there, so it's always really good. First thing you wanna do is tap this pipe and grab the gem. There is a giant heart in one of the gravestones here, but we're just gonna. Kind of tap this one. Oh, is it this one? Is it this one? There they are! You gotta go through these guys before you do anything else. This is where the firepower comes in handy. You can always kind of freak off, oh, freak them out with a fire, making them easier to catch. Fortunately, you have to deal with three at once, for Pete's sake. Ugh. I'm just gonna burn you. And then the big gravestone lights up. And, oh, there's my little brother. And here's where the big heart is hidden. And, alright. Step one, walk up to the big gravestone and get the living spoot scared out of ya. By Bogmire. Wait, I can't believe I never realized this more. His name is two words for a swamp combined into one: Bog and Mire. What? How come I never realized that before? Um. Hell. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's a shadow. A shadow proclamation for bitch copying of your shadow. Uh, what do you need? Alright, this is step one. Or, well, step two, really, because step one was the. Grab a shadow, walk up to him. Code him in goo! Step two. Oh, apparently, suck completely. And avoid the fireballs. Uh, just destroy the little ones. And don't get hit, no matter what you do. If you want gold, you gotta have like over 90 health all right now that I got some ammo here where the heck is he here he is how'd I miss what was that what is this crap there we go now I got him oh my what is, oh, is Jesus my controller malfunctioning again because it doesn't uh, oh 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 uh, hello That almost ended badly. By the way, you can get struck by lightning in this game, so this boss is actually really easy. Just coat him in goo, avoid getting hit. Ah! Oh! Yeah, you can get struck by lightning. It happened to Dad once when he was playing this. The biggest thing is to just basically avoid taking damage at all costs. There really is no... What? Oh my goodness! I am sucking this time. Okay, if you um, if you don't need anything, could you please go upstairs? Oh, I missed him! I swear by the hairs under Luigi's nose, I will miss again. Oh, that's okay, I got big ammo this time. Hard to hit with the bazooka. Walk up, walk up, walk up. Ah, fire! Oh my goodness, so close. And this is where things start to get serious. Spook, it's real, yo. The shadows get faster. There's more of them. Definitely more big ones. Oh, 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 oh my. Um. Let's just end this. Yes! 100% health. That's really, I don't even need to make this one a boss time. It's such an easy boss. You just, just go through it. And that solves that. You get a big green key that matches Luigi's hat.
Beautiful. That's the, the Luigi key. Oh, what's this? Oh, we are only five minutes into the episode. Hey, you know what? My little bro was right. This is a five-minute boss. Luigi, can you hear me? Good. Well, technically, the boss itself took me less than five minutes because I started with the skeleton part. Anyways, um, lightning struck. That battle had you there. Come back to the lab. You think the lightning damaged Poltergeist 3000? Don't worry about it. Even if the lightning rod had cooked your goose, your Poltergeist 3000 wouldn't even add a scratch. Oh, that's reassuring. Uh, I, I'm disposable. We're on through the ghost fortification either. I don't see why we didn't have the people ghosts and put them in portraits in the second game. That was so bummer. Like, really, dude. Alright, look at all those tiny little ghosts in there. There's more ghosts than either Area 2 or 3. I think it's Area 2 that has the most. Oh, wait, it's Area 3. Definitely Area 3? Th I don't know. Ghosts are invisible. So we need to... Press them into visible forms. Presto! Turn them into beautiful ghost portraits. Gold! Gold! Another gold! Boy, I'm good. Another gold! And another gold! Where's the dog? I got the dog gold too, right? Yes! Perfect score for area two! All gold. So far, only one of them is silver. Look at all that cash! Go back to the mansion! I don't even... I'll look at the gallery when I'm finished with the game. <clears throat> Alright, you guys just saved it, so... Let's use this new key. Where does it go? It goes... This is really slow. It goes right there. Now the hallways are lit up here. So I can scrounge around for some gold. Ooh, gold brick! Yes! Seven minutes into this episode. We have to end it. Uh, this, this episode went really well. Oh, I don't have any firepower again. I wanted to burn the door mercilessly. The heart. I don't want hearts. I want... Oh, wait! Since I'm here, you guys may as well just... Show Madame Clairvoya. Come on, come here, you stupid fortune teller lady. Why do I have to summon you? Alright, show the item of the magical voice. It's Mario's hat! Why, it's clean as if someone just washed it. Sorry, sometimes I like to add a little drama, you know? Hmm, just one moment. Did I just say Mario? Could it be that that Mario? Sociopath that uh, is horribly mean and abusive to everyone he knows and loves? Ah, I see it. Well, I see everything. I saw it before. He's a horrible person. He's a sociopath. The game theorists are right. Now I really see it. So you are the brother of the famous Mario, you poor, poor soul. And you have come to this place to find him? Well, why? Why? Um, well, aren't you a good little brother? <laughs> I feel bad for you. Um, excuse me. I don't laugh much. Oh, I also have a male voice. Oh, here come the spirits. They're scary. They're big. They're powerful. They cause the whole mansion to shake. You'd think that because I'm catching ghosts, spirits wouldn't have to want to help me. Because, you know, ghosts are spirits too. And, you know, everything's going shaky. I mean, if you had to fight these spirits, though, you'd, there's no way you'd live. You'd die. Totally. Oh, show us this Mario. The light of the spirits. Come, show us what we seek. Um, Mario lives. Well, that's reassuring in a mansion of dead people. Um, he's alive. Excuse me, where is he? Uh, where is he now? Ah, the spirits fell silent. Another clue. All right, go get another thing. Um, oh, that that just really end this episode. That's that's pretty much it. Treasure one more time. Dang it! See you all next time.